Hello everyone, my name is Jackie. In this video, I'm showing you guys how to flash your laptop V-Bias to increase the GPU wattage or TGP so that you can get the most out of your laptop GPU performance. In this example, I will try to flash my laptop from 90 watt to 130 watt. So let's get started. Firstly, before you do anything else, make sure you create a restore point to be super safe, just in case something does not going well. You always want a backup when doing something like this. The first step is to download the VBIOS that you want to use. In this case, I use RTX 3060 90 watt and I want to flash it to 130 watt. If you have similar specs like mine, check the link in the description to download this ASUS VBIOS. Click the download now button to download the VBIOS file. After you have done download it, rename the VBIOS file to your preference. But remember to not include the space. Use symbols like dash as the space, or else your VBIOS will not get recognized. After that, you need to download this file for NV Flash. Check the link in the description too. After you have done download it, extract the file. And then move the ASUS VBIOS that you just renamed into the second VBIOS folder. Select your GPU here. In this case I use RTX 3060, so I will put it inside the RTX 3060 folder. To start flashing, open your CMD and run it as administrator. After that, Copy the current address bar at the top. Inside the CMD, type in CD space and then paste it here. Press enter. To back up our current VBIOS into a file, type in nvflash dash b and then name the file to your preference without the space. Put .rom at the end for the file extension. Just press enter. After that, you need to type in nvflash space double dash and then protect off. It's just to unlock the permission so that you can flash your VBIOS. Press enter. Now type in NV flash, and then type in the ASUS VBIOS file name that we will use. Make sure the spelling is exactly the same like you see here. After you press enter, the process will begin. You will be asked to type in yes with all caps. Just do it, and then proceed by keep pressing Y until the system asks for a reboot. After the process is done, just reboot your laptop. Now you might notice your laptop GPU no longer detected. Or your system tray here might disappear. Even if you open the device manager, your dedicated laptop GPU is missing. What to do now? Don't panic. Just perform a DDU. I already have a dedicated tutorial on how to use DDU, so I will not show you in this video. After you have done the DDU, your laptop GPU will come back to life. You can check your GPU wattage through NVIDIA control panel. It will change if you follow all the steps correctly. That's it. I hope this video was helpful, and if it does, feel free to like, comment and subscribe to my channel. I will see you in my next tutorial. Bye.